Hey guys, this is Feeding Frenzy 91, and I'm talking about microtransaction. What a lot of people don't seem to like, but apparently what a lot of people like to buy, because Activision Blizzard has announced that they've made around 1.2 billion dollars in the last quarter off microtransactions. Not in the last year, in the last quarter. That's about three months, or 90 days is the guy from Gameranks put it. So this just goes to show for certain genres, I think. It just makes sense for them to bring them out in free to play or as it was Call of Duty Warzone, where at least part of the game is free to play and just have a bunch of microtransactions. Here, and here's the thing, let me just explain about me. Personally, I barely buy microtransactions. I'm not saying I've never bought them, but I barely buy them. If the microtransactions are all cosmetics, I just don't care like that because I'm playing the game, right? Yes, do I care a little bit about how my gun or if it could look cooler? Yeah, sure, I'll make it look cooler. If, if I can make my character look a little bit more how I want the character to look, yeah. But to pay real money to do that, it's that's where the caring stops. I'm like, it doesn't affect the gameplay, so I don't care that much about it to buy the microtransactions. Now, I know that's not everybody. Some people really like the cosmetics and whatever. But what I'm really saying is that it doesn't seem like these are going anywhere anytime soon. Only God really knows, but they don't really have a reason to stop it. I mean, so many people are buying them, so this could possibly be a way a lot of franchises, especially franchises in this particular genre, go down the road, but only God really knows. What do you guys think about Activision Blizzard announcing that they made $1.2 billion off microtransactions this last quarter? Let me know in the comments below. Thanks for watching, like, subscribe. May God bless you all.